Hi Sagittarius, I hope you're doing awesome. This is a quick little daily reading for you. I'm sorry if the lighting looks like not the best. One of my light bulbs went out, so we just gonna make it work, okay? <laughs> All right, for my Sagittariuses today, for my Sagittariuses, Holy Spirit, can you give me a message for my Sagittariuses? What is going on for them today? Their overall energy for today? Sagittarius, some of you Sagittarius are worried about your creativity, about worrying about your, um, trying to find balance between create, something you're trying to create, like something creative that you're trying to do and find balance and finding the strength I'm getting for some of you Sagittarius. Okay. Sagittarius. Yeah, we have the Ten of Wands, so some of you might be feeling a little burnt out I'm getting for today. Um... Okay, when I'm looking at this card, something about a distance, from a distance, like, how do I say this? Something about something at a distance is like kind of weighing you down. That's for someone here. I'm getting something about maybe it's you trying to get to the, get to a destination and you're starting to feel burnt out here, but you're almost there. I'm getting like you're almost there. Sagittarius obstacle for today. Yeah, your obstacle is the King of Cups. Some of you might have a water sign. That's a bit of an obstacle for you for some, re some, for some reason. For you being, I feel like for some of you Sagittarius, is you being tolerant of something. Um, you being tolerant, like you're feeling burnt out. You're starting to feel a little burnt out and you're starting to not feel as tolerant. For some of you, it may even involve a a water sign. The advice for Sagittarius. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm laughing. The Knight of Swords right here. Don't cut someone's head off today. Like, don't like, I literally cut someone's head off, but don't go like ham on someone. I feel like someone might be testing your patience. It could be this King of, of Cups here, this water sign here. Um, Make sure that you don't, um, like, go off. Because Sagittarius, when y'all go off, y'all can go off and go in. And you don't give a damn about hurting nobody's feelings. <laughs> I'm married to a Sag. My sister's a Sag. My dad's a Sag, okay? So, yeah, you might you might be tempted to kind of go off because you are feeling a bit, you know, burnt out with something. But I did see, like, if you look at my next 72 hours, and I've been seeing this for a while, I feel like a lot of you Sagittariuses are going through, like, a graduation period in the spiritual realm. Like, what I mean by that, Sag, is I see, like, a group of the babies, I call y'all babies, <laughs> um, like, starting to graduate, like, one after another. You guys are getting, like, big blessings to take you to the next level. And this goes to all the Sages who have been feeling burnt down, like, burnt yeah overburned burdened with things been through a lot of financial hardships but you guys continue to show strength and you keep going and a lot of people would have quit already and this has been happening for a couple of years for you Sagittarius. sure there's been a couple of mistakes but you guys did a really good job so i feel like this is like in 2022 there's like many of you that are like graduating like if that doesn't happen within the next if it doesn't happen for you within the next month, because mine's was in the next 72. Um, so that's like in the week, a week or so, or pretty much within a month, or even like in the next couple of months, it is it is coming. I feel like a lot of it is going to happen for Sag by the end of 2022, okay? So don't get sus discouraged. I feel like by the end of 22, it's definitely happening for the Sages. I feel it. It's, it's I'm very proud of you guys, like very proud of you, especially with my husband because he's gone through a lot too. Okay, let's see what else is happening for my Sages. Yeah, okay. We have the camel right here. Persevere and you will overcome your problems. So they're telling you to keep going like I was just saying. For some of you, there may be something to do with a camel, like literally something to do with a camel. Then we have the barrel right here. So I feel like some of you might be feeling um, today like something and it's about money because I'm really drawn to what spirit is telling me to look at the word money right here. Um, dissatisfaction when it comes to your money. But trust me, 
it's about to get so much better for you, Sag. It really is. And then, what do they say? Another another level, another level, another another devil. You know, that's just what's gonna happen. But you're about to pass this level. You guys have passed. <clears throat> yeah. And then we have be careful, don't take risk. You might be tempted to take risk. I'm also getting something to do with like claws. I don't know if someone's looking at claws or the show claws. Um, something about a claw or something. Someone might be even drawing a claw. I know this is very weird, but that's what I'm getting as well. Um, but they're telling you don't take a risk right here. And especially don't like attack someone because they're really getting on your nerves. Or just do something without thinking. Because sometimes the Knight of Wands can just rush and do something. Um, make sure that you're not doing that right now. Ooh, and I'd love to see the bottom of the deck right here. Look at that, the dolphin. I know it's kind of like probably not focusing very well. But my camera's not focusing. Okay, there we go. It says... Financial gain usually come usually coming from something you did in the past. There's about to be a financial gain for you, Sagittarius. All right. Your affirmation for today. Your affirmation is, I am loved. I am kind to myself today and to those around me. I love that. I am loved. I am kind to myself and those around me. Okay. Yeah, be kind to the people around you. Because I feel like for some of you, you might be a little tested. Somebody might be getting on your damn nerves. I'm not lying. Okay. Oh, I want to pull um, from my Zodiac. Let's see what else is going on before I do your um, self-care message. Let's see. What else is going on for Sag today? For Sag? I just want one. Okay, we ended up getting two. That's fine. We have heart and home. So I do see you having a very happy home um, and feeling very loved and comfort. Like you're a lot of comforting. Your home life is looking very nice, I'm getting, for today. And then we have roundabouts. Oh, you guys are going to be heading to a new direction. Um, there's something about you going in a new direction with something. And this is happening in perfect timing. There's some type of redirection today I'm getting. Okay, let's get your self-care message for you, Sages. Let me run. This one came, down, came out too, okay. Cancer just got this one, but this one came out too. Sovereign right here, your crown, okay? It says, you are the queen of your life. Treat yourself like royalty today, okay? So you are the queen of your life. Treat yourself like royalty. If you're a male, just means you are the king of your life, okay? You have say so over your life. You do. The power of the tongue. Remember that. All right, Sagittarius, you go out there and have a wonderful day. Love you all. Bye.